Welcome back. President John F. Kennedy was a great lover of American culture. He asked Robert Frost to read his inaugural poem. He regularly invited authors and artists to the White House. Now, when it comes to culture, President-elect Trump is going for a slightly different vibe. It's the subject of this week's State of the Cartoonian. Screw off, coastal elites. Donald Trump is stacking his administration with leaders from real American pop culture. Wow. His pick to head the Small Business Administration is Linda McMahon, CEO of WWE, making her, I'm pretty sure, the only head of that agency to have ever survived one of Stone Cold Steve Austin's Stone Cold Stunners. That's the bottom line, cause Stone Cold sucks up. His pick to be Secretary of Labor runs the Carl's Jr. and Hardee's franchise, infamous for those racy commercials with scantily clad models. Have you ever been seduced by a burger before? His pick to have the Treasury Department served as an executive producer on Mad Max Fury Road. And of course, we learned this week that the next season of Celebrity Apprentice, starring Arnold Schwarzenegger and featuring Snooki, I'll be back. will have Donald Trump as an executive producer. Is it ridiculous to wonder if the inaugural poem will be given by Andrew Dice Clay? Hickory dickory duck! Oh!